With there being millions of different life forms here on Earth, how exactly do we select which ones we're going to examine to see if they can be used as sources of new drugs? Well, there are actually a number of different ways to do this. One way is to look at the knowledge that's been collected before us. For example, the indigenous peoples of Australia have been using particular plants as medicines for tens of thousands of years. This provides us with a scientific basis from which we can start with for a plant to see if we can further develop it to discover new drugs. Another way is to sample organisms from diverse environments. Here in Australia, we are lucky in that we live in one of the most biodiverse countries on Earth. This typically equates to high chemical diversity. So essentially, we have a range of natural products literally on our doorstep. A great resource we have here in Australia that provides us with a unique collection of natural samples that we can use in drug discovery is Nature Bank. I'd now like to pass over to Associate Professor Rowan Davis, Academic Lead for Nature Bank, to explain more. Nature Bank is a unique biodiscovery resource that is housed at the Griffith Institute for Drug Discovery in Brisbane, Australia. Nature Bank currently consists of over 30,000 Australian plant, mushroom and marine invertebrate samples. These samples are collectively known as biota. These biota have been processed into extract and fractions that can be sent to researchers around the world who are wanting to test them against a range of diseases in the search for new drugs. The biota in the Nature Bank collection has been collected through collaborations with the Queensland Herbarium and the Queensland Museum. The Herbarium have collected and identified just over 20,000 plant samples, mostly from the state of Queensland. The Queensland Museum collects marine invertebrates um, for, for Nature Bank. These are things like marine sponges, ascidians, soft and hard corals and mollusks. The collection of biota samples is done sustainably with only very small quantities um, obtained, typically around 100 grams. These samples have been ground up, processed and archived um, in Nature Bank and it is expected that, that they will last hundreds of years. Just small portions of the archived samples are taken for further analysis. Nature Bank has a focus on the discovery of new drugs, but the samples can also be used for the discovery of new animal health products, agrochemicals, food ingredients and additives, nutraceuticals and cosmeceuticals. The Nature Bank team continues to collect biota samples from diverse environments within Australia. For example, we have a collaboration with the Steve Irwin Wildlife Reserve in far north Queensland to collect unique uh, biota samples, predominantly plants and mushrooms. The reserve, which is made up of 35 different ecosystems, provides a habitat and a refuge for a vast array of plants and animals. The unique biodiversity that is protected within the reserve has the potential for being the source of future human medicines.